Hello everyone. Today we will uh, discuss about the Risa Insta in a root volume and in a data volume set on over the AWS. So let's start. Um, we do have already a one server is running right. We do have a two volume set there right. And uh, it's a 888 GB and this is the 5 GB. Let's see first 8 GB and 5 GB right. Plus VLP, but this is the 5 GB, this is the 8 GB. Okay, so let's uh, upgrade first these sites, right? If this is, uh, and then we'll do that in inside the server, right? Make it chair. is 5 GB make it 10 modify okay so these were the sites make sure if you are doing the production so you should have a, a volume buffer uh, data volume snapshot and uh, uh, root volume which volume you are doing if you are root volume so you should have a snapshot okay this is my ls bak this is 10 but it's still 8 right this is 10 but it's still 5 so let's suppose how can i check check which is the format type of the format of block id is a command so this is our root volume so how can I say root volume is type of XFS this is our XDV1 type of EXT file okay so let's uh, let's start first ls blk so initially if you are going to uh, EXT code so I had already copied so this is the command I'll tell you why I am putting one right this is xvdb right this is xvdb and this is the first part is right are you getting okay so first run this okay change next resize to fs is completely this this part need to be written okay at the end db Okay, this is done. Now ls blk. This is 10. This is 10. Here 10, 5. Okay. Now let's suppose we are we have to do xvda1. Right? Okay. So what we need to do? It's a group part. Okay. What is this? Okay. And you need to group part and do the same command but uh, it is x f s underscore grow f s dev x v d a 1 we need to which partition we are doing is this partition to this so initially grow which partition 1 and then initially it's a, it's a 1 divide and then so do this Okay, PLAR LSBLK. This is 10. This is 10. This is 10. This is 10. Now your volume is upgraded. Just be take care. If you are going to upgrade, we can do in the running server as well. No issues as well. But if something uh, by mistakenly happened in the production, so who will take care? So make sure if you are going to upgrade uh, any server volume, 
make sure you should have a snap volume snapshot thank you thanks for watching